down, but I guess I'll run through it again real quick. Pat, do you know about the game uh, <clears throat> War Thunder? Sorry. This game is basically Battlefield by the people who made War Thunder. <laughs> to try to explain it as simple as possible. Nope. Okay. So War Thunder is basically a game where it's free to play, but you can play it as plain um, tank or a... Um, I think it, the thing is mainly plane and tank. There might be ships too. I forget. But essentially, when you join a game, you pl you select one of them, and then um, you spawn in as that. And then once all your like tanks are destroyed, then you you leave, and then you join another game, or you can spectate if you really want. But I don't remember if there's like a advantage to spectating. This game's similar, but the really cool thing is you spawn in with a squad of people, and then after you spawn in, game's kind of quiet now, so let me turn it up a bit now. Turn the master volume up. Oh, that's awesome. That's probably why right there. Turn it back down a bit. Yeah, it should be a little bit better. Uh, but yeah, so you spawn in with your full squad and everything. And then after you spawn in, uh, you can select different members of your squad and do different uh, objectives and stuff. It's groups of 10v10, uh, but then of course because you spawn in with a squad, it becomes a lot, a lot more than that on the battlefield the entire time. Like I said, I, I technically did this uh, tutorial on my other account that I made. For the sake of being able to play the game before I figured out how to link your Steam account. But it's pretty quick. Once we finish off this part, then we're we're all set. Luckily I didn't get too far into the game. I know the tank's pretty loud, so hold on. And that's it. That is all of the tutorial right there. So. I don't think you really get anything from doing that. So let's see. So you can also check whether you want to join as a allied or axis. The one thing that kind of sucks for th this type of game is I'm pretty sure uh, each each team or country that you work for or that you are um, using, that team specifically has characters and people that you have to upgrade. So it's not like you hit level two on uh, the axis that you'll be level two on the uh, allied you have to individually level each one but that's it's not too bad so here we are one sec I think the game is a little bit loud for so this is my squad right here I, of course, am myself, but these guys with the green on their head, they're all AI squad mates. If I want to swap to anyone, I can hit Y, and now I'm in control of this guy. That was the guy that I just was. 
Now, if I press it again, boom, 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 boom. And that's basically how it works. Now, it's pretty, uh, pretty quick. When you go down, if you swap to another character, then that guy will continue healing himself. And then once your entire squad wipes, then you can spawn in as your new squad. Um, it's pretty neat, in my opinion. It's some pretty cool stuff here. Yeah, and the map's pretty big too. Uh, right now we're pushing, of course. I'm walking into barbed wire. It's also fairly easy to get some kills. A lot of times I think that's another, um, another person. Yeah, you can see the guys in there right now. I'm trying to have a clear shot before I take one. The like voice lines are very low. It looks pretty decent too, I, I will say. Like this is, this right now is beta. If they release this in like full said like this is uh, early access release, I would be a-okay with that. Because it, it works pretty good for what it is. Like there. <laughs> we have all these guys running past me. So I just died, I can swap in. I know my whole entire squad got wiped. Nice. It's just such a cool technique in my opinion. spawning in with the new squad oh my god dude are you serious surprised how uh, how good the game runs too like right now we're getting a good like 80 frames or so kind of hard to see but in the bottom left um, it does have the frames and other things uh, other stats too I'm really glad that I saw this game or found out about this thing that I kind of wish is I wish you could see the Jesus I wish you could see your teammates names because it's ve they're very like hidden like you can't really see them well or at all like I haven't figured out how to see them oh, damn it I think I'm the only one left Would you say the the game's too loud? Cause I can turn it down. Jesus. I will say my first game on my other character did, uh, or my other uh, account did a lot better than this, <laughs> but that's okay. Damn.
Whoa, no way. I actually got that guy? Holy crap. pretty sick that's the first time i saw someone fall out of the sky like that nice so we got the the first objective um so now we're moving on to the next one Peace. i definitely noticed that some Sometimes the, like, even though it looks like you can make the shot, you can't because there's a, a platform in your way. I definitely noticed that a few times here and there. Wow, these guys are actually still alive. Yeah, that's just about how I was expecting that one to go. So, this guy, we have smoke grenades. I think the game's a little too loud. thought the uh the mini map is a little weird i kind of wish it was the other way around where it, uh it would rotate with you or something something around, along those lines because right now it's kind of hard to see um sometimes not all the time but it can be a little weird oh shoot Nice. Got three people with that. Holy crap. It seems so quiet, dude. There's like no balancing. Nice. We're capturing it now. I don't know, is there actually a voice chat? Uh, press, oh my God. So that was me a second ago. And as you can see, he's healing himself now. And then he'll probably get up. Yep, there it is. So I think that's a little bit more useful instead of using your energy to heal yourself. You can protect your, uh, your person by swapping to a separate character what is the uh push to talk i'm just curious must be a voice chat f2 that is such a weird keybind
Jeez. I need to look at the markers again. Gun reload, switch member, throw a grenade. Uh, explosion pack. The tank is literally stuck. Honestly, haven't I don't know if I've ever seen a, a game with this type of technique before where like this is all AI and in all those those groups of people there's one real person um, I really like that like you can swap to them it's very fast-paced And then later on down down the line too you can unlock more soldiers and cooler perks for your people and things like that so it's very like there there is a building aspect to it damn i think you actually shot him yeah i'll go in as this guy Wow, we actually got three objectives so far. So I haven't played as Axis yet, but I'm assuming the way it works is we have to capture all the objectives before they deplete all of our tickets down to zero, which is very like typical for a game mode, but that's okay. Like, reasonable can't even see this guy there there are um, commands too not exactly sure like what all of them do just yet but I, I just realized right now too, right above your mini map, it actually tells you which character you're currently playing as, how many kills you have, what equipment you have, and then how many people are alive. So out of the three members in this squad, there's only one, two left. And now it's just me. So when I die, we'll have to uh, swap into a new character. Nice. There are leaning mechanics. I haven't really used them much, but as you can see, it, it, right now, I think by default it's set to hold. So I probably would change that to toggle. Oh God. Not too bad though. Not too bad before that. Let me, uh, real quick, let me just check the controls. So, we know that. Uh, mark enemy, scores, briefing, chat, game menu, other. Drop gun.
Plane vehicle squad. Artillery strike switch member battle cry. Huh, there's a battle cry option. That's pretty sick. Uh, is there a toggle? Firing mode, mount weapon, leaning. Squad, clean, uh, show pie menu. Other interface, spectator. It's so cool how like, <laughs> the people actually yell. I was playing uh, the other day I was playing War of Rights with uh, Lyric. I think it was yesterday and um, pretty, pretty fun game, especially when you actually have people that are like doing what they're supposed to do. Like everyone lining up in formation. Oof. Uh, I have two more guys left. I was playing. No, I was actually, I joined, um, so I was watching him play War of Rights, but then I also, um, the, the game lobby is like, they're really not that full a lot of times. So there's typically only like one uh, server that has like all members. And then there's like another server that's typically half full. Um, max, I believe the highest number of people is like 150. But still, that's, that's like equal. Um, so I, I was able to get in and I was actually, so I was watching a stream, but I was also uh, playing in the background very subtly just to be a part of it you know oh god i can't get a single shot let's see yeah i was in the same one as him Yeah, since there's only like one like big server, um, that's the one he joined because it's it's the most populated. And then you could tell there's definitely other people from the stream that were joining too. But uh, it was pretty neat. It was pretty cool. It's nice when your teammates are actually nearby. Nice. <laughs> That's definitely another guy. Wait, you can pick up his weapon? What the heck? Damn. No! You just said, uh, you just happened to use on the same game all casual, like, yeah. No, 100% it was, uh, doing a little bit of, uh, stream sniping but trust me there's a lot oh my god holy camera shake
<laughs> There's definitely a lot of other people doing it too though. I like just being there for like the presence. It's cool uh, sometimes. And there it is. So we just uh, leveled up and we got another squad. So this is the next squad that you unlock, which is the 69th tank battalion. And then as you can see, each character went up one star. Um, I guess these guys can only go up one time. Meanwhile, this guy, since he's a rank three, he can go up three times. Uh, same thing with these two guys. And then we actually didn't even get to play as the squad the last game. That's pretty much how this game works. It's pretty neat though. Um, I've been having a good amount of fun with it so far. I've only really played like, that was probably my third match. Second or, th no, no, third, yeah. Um, so let's level up each one and then keep on, uh, keep on going here. Uh, reduce the effect of head shaking caused by nearby explosives. I'll take the 100% stamina. Decreasing the shots right after quick turning of the firearm. Uh, I'll take stamina. These are a lot different than what my previous characters were getting. Faster decreasing the shot spread after quick turning. Sure, we'll take it for that one. Yeah, this one I really like the 60% movement. And that one too. The faster being able to stand up. Longer breath while hold, while aiming, sure. 40% max jump height? Sure. Alright, so now we get into the upgrades portion. So this here lets you increase your squad size, but then you can also get other items. You can get more XP, uh, increase it some more, more XP, all that stuff. I really like how like everything has a one way or another to increase like level and rewards i think that's pretty neat in my opinion um we also have other people up here that we can recruit too so weaponry and then troops items i think what we'll do is we're gonna increase that one and right now i think we only have one point I don't think we can really do anything. Oh no, it's per squad. I just realized that it's per squad. So cool. We can actually increase this one too. Rank two sniper. Ah, that's how you unlock the firearm. Personnel upgrades. Sidearm. sidearm options right there okay I see I see let's increase the squad size because the more people you have the better right for the squad at least then trooper uh, so we can equip two trooper people so at level 3 you can get an engineer fighter pilot flame trooper six you know what we could hold off and get like some of these higher level guys yeah that would actually be kind of cool that gunner almost looks like modern <laughs> yeah let's uh let's hold off for now because we might as well it would be nice to have another character but your overall um even check that actually 
is a better question. Finish your second battle, finish your third battle while wow, you get... Oh, okay, so you get a, actually get another trooper card and another weapon card once you complete these. So these are like your battle pass. Spend 10 minutes in battles. Oh, let's go to the next one. I think that when you have the the toggle for join any team, I think that's specific to if you can't find a match that is allied, then it'll be like, okay, after a certain amount of time, it'll say, all right, I'll put you into a an axis match. Because everything so far I ran into, I've been able to get into... Uh, these matches how's keto so <laughs> so this week was actually pretty good um me and my buddy after easter sunday uh we've been texting each other back and forth and he's like a real fitness nut so he's actually pretty good at it and stuff so me and him were like talking to each other and hitting the gym and everything but we both fell off uh, about midway through the week. So, and then I will admit 100% yesterday, I, I don't know, yesterday I just stopped caring for the day. And today I'm going to um, try not really to eat anything else today. Um, so we're going to reset again. But besides that, it was actually going pretty good. We, uh, we're, we're staying on top of each other. Or trying to, to keep track of each other so that way we can, uh, you know, a little bit easier. I got six months. <laughs> oh god. executed literally I I might start using the other squad like this guy's okay but the other squad has a lot more people and I'm not really the biggest like sniper person out there like sniping is cool and all but yeah that Yeah, I mean, I've been I've been going at least like two times a week. Um, I definitely need to get back into it again, like go on at at least like my goal is at least four times a week, and then doing two uh, two days of doing like some sort of activity. Um, and the funny thing is, too, me and Rachel have been actually going together. So she's been coming with me um, when I go while she's doing her own thing. So we've been actually pushing each other too. Oh my god, dude, I can't see anything right now. Five days a week, yeah. So, alright, so what do you do on five days? See, my problem is I ha I struggle to find five days where I can do things. The way I, I do it is typically I do like chest, like... So chest and triceps... 
um, legs, shoulders. Now these are all separate days. Like chest and triceps is one day. Uh, legs is another day. Shoulders is another day. Uh, back and biceps is the fourth day. Right, that's four days. Yeah. So that's like how I do it. I can't, I, it, it's always hard for me, unless if like I double pack on something and did something uh, twice. Like if I did lightweight chest twice or something of that sort. just altering oh okay gotcha gotcha see one of like the, the other things i kind of wanted to try so i have a, a rower in my basement now so i've been kind of wanting to do like like more a lightweight morning like workout in a way where i do like i don't know shoulders or chest with like dumbbells just to get moving and a little bit of the rower but i have yet to uh to do it for the weekend it started all over again on monday gotcha I'll see if I can reset tomorrow. Like, as in do that tomorrow morning. I, I always like seeing, like, days as where, like, you messed up as resets. Because it's like, okay, yeah, you made, yeah, you made a mistake, but you can always reset the next day and then start you know go back to what you were doing Our boys are capturing Damn. There's a way you can do third person. Radio operator, gunner. Like if I had a home gym already set up and everything, then I would have already done everything for today, like before jumping on here. But I don't, so.
control point. I'm trying to hold B. Are you serious? No way, dude. Oh my God, what the hell? I can't. this thing explode are you serious We need to leave and then repair it. Jeez. Oh my god! Oh no! Correct. This, ah, oh dude, this mechanic is so neat in my opinion. I feel like this is what, this is the type of, uh, operations that battlefield is going for i would love it if they implemented something like like a squad system like this but because it would be perfect for that but i guess we'll have to wait and see if that ever happens Oh, nice. So anything I do, he'll do.
Oh, <laughs> oh my god, he just came in and started. Oh my god. <laughs> he went straight for the knife. What is my oh my name is Cat's ass in this? It wouldn't let me change my name to to Cassis Clay. So yeah, I lost. I did um when I was doing my thing, um. I lost about five pounds. Now it was most like most likely water weight and stuff. But still, because I was in a pretty heavy like um caloric deficit for like two or three days my goal during the week at least is to be under low carbs and under like 1200 calories for around 12 which if i plan my meals and everything it's pretty reasonable and it, and not eating like doesn't affect me too much the one day I felt like Wednesday or so um, that I was eating already and stuff, but I felt like crap. Um, I don't know what, what like came over me, but I just felt sick for the day. And then like Thursday is when I kind of like broke out because I was like, whatever. My meals were still decent, but it was my overall uh, Oh God. I was eating like candy and stuff from Easter. I hate how long it takes to pull out your knife. All my guys are dead. Oh my god. Sir, you guys aren't even looking the correct way. Holy. Oh god. That is definitely a bad guy. I didn't know that there was a uh, dismemberment in this. Oh God. Well 
I didn't realize at first that you actually don't start with a side uh, a sidearm. I, I kept getting confused why I couldn't pull one out, but you literally don't have one. What the hell is this? No! <laughs> ah, shoot. Well, okay. Uh, let's go for tank still over at Charlie then. We're kind of doing that great. So there are multiple maps for each campaign then. Cause this one is, we're still under Normandy. Um, Normandy's campaign. And right now we're not doing too bad. So. I thought it was only gonna be like one, one or uh, one map her campaign but seems like there's multiple and i'm assuming there's probably different factions if you go to uh the the other faction uh the other campaign i mean because it's in moscow it's like the battle for moscow i believe Take that. Rip. 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 Did my other guy survive? Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, my my last soldier is dead. Hello, hello. Ah. <laughs> Spectating. Oh, we're out of. Oh wow. All right, one second, chat. First loss. Still got a point though. Not bad. Uh, squad upgrades. So squad size increase, increase the maximum by another soldier. 
uh, sniper you want to use. Increase the maximum number of sniper, radio operators, or that. Okay. So, oh, uh, you can only choose one. I see, I see. Or you can do the squad gets more XP. Um. Or sidearm. Yeah, sidearm would be pretty useful, to be honest. Do that. Rank two unlocks maximum soldier level for this class. The higher the soldier rank, the higher the maximum level and number of perks this soldier can have. Okay. So every time you level, I guess you get another squad point to use campaign level three. What's my overall? Okay, level two, let's see. Um, let's do for this one engineer or a radio operator. What do radio operators do? Does it tell you? I go to soldiers, manage soldiers, logistics, maybe academy. Reserve, no available soldier. So choose three soldiers of the same rank to start training. Lose control of them. Oh, okay. I see, I see. This one gives you a engineer group. Pretty neat, pretty neat. I'm gonna swap those two so that way I can go back and forth between these faster. Uh, hit okay. Upgrades. For these guys, what would I rather do? Upgrading the previous one is required. Hmm. Yeah, I guess increase the squad size. And once we hit the next one, we can increase it again if we want or something. This one. Squad size or rank two sniper. How many do we have right now? I think this squad can hold th four, three, four, four people. Four is okay for a sniper. Uh, sniper. A sniper squad so I guess we'll do we'll do rank 2 sniper soldiers I even got I haven't even gotten any abilities for this guy yet let's get that reward thank you Take that one thank you Limited to three per day by the premium pass to increase this to nine. Jeez. Take reward. Okay. Wow. So we actually got right now we can recruit three people and then also get some weapons too. So can they automatically equip sidearms or no? Permission to use this uh, slot for can be acquired through the squad upgrade system. Ah. Hmm. I see. So who has the somebody has sidearm option? Right? I thought we did. Sidearm is locked for all these guys? Really? I thought I just unlocked it. Didn't I just unlock it? Sidearm slot for troopers oh secondary weapon slot uh. what is sidearm then oh uh, I 
I'm stupid. I see. I see now. So it is sidearm. Okay. But that's a secondary weapon weapon. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Cool. Now I understand that. Um what do we have? So we can do one gold. I completely forgot Kiara was in here. In my room. He's making my bed. Uh, okay. Let's do a... We have enough points and we'll get more. So that's uh, all right anyways, to be honest. E mode. Oh, okay. Small backpack, ammo patch. Okay, I see how that works now. Weapons delivery. Okay, so this is how you swap weapons for people. Not bad. You can straight up buy this squad. Let's go one assaulter. Nice, he's level two. And one trooper. Level three, nice. Then we'll throw the, I think the trooper has to go in this one. There, nice. Now we have two level three. And okay. This guy can go in here. He's level two, so I'm gonna swap him up there. Okay. Boom. Uh, does he already? So I wonder if they come equipped with. Ah, uh, they don't. They do not come equipped with the med. Med kit. Med pack. Medic. Item or a grenade. They actually have to equip them with one if you like them to have one. This guy, I'm gonna give a grenade. Uh, what does this guy have? He has a. Does I always spawn in as him? Uh, I'm gonna give him a Molotov. Good, good. Explosive pack. Nothing. No grenade. Okay, that's fine. Grenade. That guy, this guy can have a explosive pack. Mine, now we're good. That's fine. So when it comes to sidearms, need level seven army level. US army level, okay. Knife, that's fine. Can't really change anything with that, I guess. Logistics. Get a weapon delivery. So you could buy one of these if you wanted to. I'm honestly good though. I'd rather wait for high level higher levels before buying any. So I think like this is good. Soldier in this class. Okay. So you can only have. We can have three troopers, but the maximum squad size is five. We could add another sniper to this group. Actually, not a bad idea. Um, I have enough for one more, but we'll get another later on, like another point. Not not a bad idea from the beginning. <laughs> okay. 
Not bad at all. Cool. Another sniper. I'll give him a uh, one of those, and he does not have a med kit. So if we go here, med kit. Med kits use, I guess, the bronze item. Small backpack, tools, grenade pouch. Okay, cool. All right, I think we're good. We're in the next game. I see I spawned hold on all right we're good we're good so apparently I got an item for watching my own stream as a twitch drop because <laughs> I have uh the whatever manager open up twitch manager and I got a notification earlier saying that I got a thing well let me actually check now eligible to get a 80 second hold on one sec one sec one sec inventory claim now yeah 80 second airborne division and then the next one wow i should have claimed this earlier is a reward pistol then allies then pistol then a tank then a reward pistol and then a supply crate okay then not bad, not bad. I guess you actually get like a uh, another airborne division. I don't know if it's a character or if it's a full on squad. Wait, am I Axis right now? Oh, I am. Okay. Rip. So all those people that I just unlocked. Oh my God. <laughs> Jeez, dude. All those people I unlocked then means that I don't get to use them. Because now I'm playing as Axis. Right in the ass. Right in the good old butt cheek. Oh my god. crap dude
Are you serious? Oh, good trade. Good trade. group you have to do the same thing again with swapping the uh the squads My God. My oh holy crap dude my team is getting absolutely wrecked right now. I'm honestly impressed how many maps there's been. In this one campaign, I have played in three maps so far. So, and they've all been in order. So I wonder if, if you switch between campaigns, I wonder if it just queues you up to the next map that you're on. Not gonna lie, I'm I'm half tempted to uh to uh put some uh, get like a 30 day thing for this. It's pretty neat. for the better. Level two. So yeah, that one that time that leveled up our um Axis people. Now we have this. We can swap those. Cool. And okay, yeah, like I thought, um uh, you only have people from one team compared to the other. That's what I figured. That's okay, too. Allows you to get as many premium battle pass rewards, including unique weapons. You can also receive all the 30 battle cross points per day. Nine combat missions. You also get 
back all enlisted gold that was spent on the premium pass by completing this next stage of the battle pass. So, how does it work? Free, free, free. So technically you don't want it until you get to that point for that. But, finish your third. Um, what's the other thing of this premium account? How much is that? I'm curious. I got nervous for a second there. I saw nine ninety nine and I was like, what? <laughs> it's not that though. It's not, not that at all. Whew. Scared me for a second, sir. Let me exit game real quick in two seconds. Is that what I just said? That's funny. They give you an extra two seconds. <laughs> 29 days. All right, let's try it out. So what do you get? So you get 100% army experience, 100 squad, soldiers, maximum infantry vehicle, uh, infantry squad in battle, plus one two times faster ac uh, academy training and plus 100 soldiers reserve cool let's do it up then one one battle so you always have constant tasks that's how many we've done today three so i think with this you can do nine if i'm or maybe oh wait no, no i think that might be for the battle pass yeah which the battle pass is separate nice we actually got into another game Wow, a fourth map? Our men are capturing Bravo. I haven't even spawned yet. There we go. Good alpha. Yuffie Kaye! Capturing the control point! I could have sworn I just saw somebody say. We got one man down. One man down. I can't see them. But apparently you did. Oh my god. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Get in cover.
It's actually kind of funny. It sucks. I don't. I don't know if you get an option to to select where you spawn. It seems like you just spawn in wherever. I can't wait until I can have like uh, items for each character or uh, sidearms for each character. The thing is level seven on the, uh, the actual team. Everybody has the option of being able to uh, hold your breath. Get some, get some, get some. Nice shot. Nice shot. I think that's a, can't tell if that's a helmet or if that's just. Yeesh. What? Is that an enemy? Uh oh, oh dude, it's like about to crash. <laughs> you can't see that they're on our team or not. Nice. That was actually funny. My whole team is dead. My my character's name, the guy, the sniper I'm playing as, his name is Steve Austin. Nice name. Oh god. Oh damn! What? He's definitely. All that coming. Eesh. It's so cool building up your squad like higher. Uh, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm just keep, keep running for now. Got him. Oh my god, dude. Are you serious? Everybody is down. Oh god, everybody is down. Damn.
everybody down? Good trade. That one was kind of rough. Like, I couldn't really tell what was going on there. I tried going through the field. shot defeat that's okay I got a few shots last second there so I want to see what we actually end up getting boom boom okay nice the thing went up a good amount right there this guy got an upgrade or a new perk fire alarms change faster yeah definitely longer breath because he's a sniper anyways, so perfect. Oh wow. I didn't even realize this guy's a level four. What? Since when? We move him to number one. Three three three. Okay. Upgrades. Wad. So let's see here. We need campaign level three. So I think your campaign level levels up. Oh, never mind. They're both level two. I was about to say it was your overall, but no, it, it's still per faction, which is okay. Um, rank four trooper, backpack slot. Increase squad size, personnel. I might honestly do the XP. I feel like the XP is the most useful. Ooh, we could also throw in a sniper into this this uh team here that would be kind of cool or an engineer i don't know what radio operators do yet so i'm gonna uh for now i'm gonna wait I'm just gonna do faster unlocks for the team uh increase squad size bomber engineer or radio operator yeah, I don't have any radio operators yet, so. Trooper, sniper, assaulter. Oh, that's cool. You can do these and it'll give you a higher one instantly starting out. So how does this work? Same start to start training. Does it level them up to the next one? Current soldier rank.
Oh, okay. One soldier will return back, back to his squad. His rank will be increased by one. His stats and perks will be reset. Will be resetted. Resetted. <laughs> one, once you send the soldiers to the academy, you lose control of them. Okay, I see. Um, I mean, we could. Or we could like recruit extra ones and then send them. I don't know though. I don't know if we really need to right this second. But it would be nice to have that as an option. Six people in one squad is a good amount. Let's do one. A do dose. Can't train soldiers that are currently with him. Oh, yeah. Oh, really? Oh, so are the other guys in my reserve then? Soldiers assigned to squads. 11. Right, you know what this would be smart because these guys don't even have anything yet a minimum four what's the minimum you need for this one you need a minimum of five now on the group. Shoot, we need three to be able to do it. Maybe we could do another trooper. Is the academy for troopers only? When do you get engineers? Engineers is at three. I wish there was somewhere that would tell you about what each, uh, like each one actually does. Oh, we get an engineer squad the next time. know what sure John Brown all right listen here you John Brown we are going to be oh, wait soldiers must meet reach uh, before oh I see now okay Train a soldier, you must replace them with a soldier from the reserve. Uh, okay. Got it, got it, got it. I see, I see. So you want to leave your, like this guy we'd want to train. And these two guys, like this one, he can go back anyways, because he's good. Um, he can go back. Take this guy, put this guy in. Is this one a maximum of five? Okay. Minimum of five, I mean. I think this one could be a minimum of four.
it's not gonna let me take him it's gonna keep pulling one of the guys from that oh maybe if I do this jeez wait James Cook get in there So they have to fill out the stars first, and then you can train them. So now these three guys, boom, 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 can increase them and they'll all go to level two. So bam, two minutes and 28 seconds. Oh, okay. Wow, that's really fast. Holy crap. I thought it was gonna be like two hours. Two hours, they'll hit like the next level. You know then they'll be good nope two minutes that works for me I can hold out for two minutes before going back into another battle okay so this one this is my airborne um let's do this yeah so definitely Getting the XP bonuses are going to be worth it then. Because then once they're high enough, you'll be able to um, continue to move them around. So where does it... I, I'm kind of confused. Why do they need a minimum of four? We don't have any sidearms yet so you can get sidearms but I guess apparently you can't fully get them until later on random trooper reinforce reinforcements uh, okay these cost silver so it's silver for a specific one but then it's bronze for anyone weaponry if we go to weapon right the random one you can get a random item or you can do these so we can get one random sure oh wow you can i didn't realize that you could upgrade weapons too auto equip Ross Mark Three. Yeah, let's give this guy a, the whatever I just got. Or maybe not. What did I just get? I thought I just got a new one. Boom, these guys finished. Jan Jansen. Congratulations, soldier. Wait. One soldier will return back to the squad. His rank will be increased by one. His stats and perks will be reset. Whoa. Oh my god. So you get one guy back. You have to sacrifice the rest and you get one person back. Oof. All right, I see how it is now. Welcome back, John. Congrats, you've been promoted and the other guys have been sacrificed. I hope it was worth it. Well, okay. I think we're good then, yes. really any other point in waiting around all right 
back to D-Day. Asian. Soldiers, move! Ah, oh, shoot. good this guy is gonna be because he's very close um, oh my god I'm not even gonna bother using that right now Oh, snap. Are you serious? Johnny Brown. by myself. Nice. It's very foggy right here. This guy has a grenade. Okay, so N does that. Somebody is firing at me. I'm going to try to get to some teammates. some Wolfenstein stuff right here. <laughs> oh, no. Damn. Wait, we don't? This guy? What? Oh, here it is. I guess I swapped the, the other sniper to the other guy. I wish I could see. It's 
Sniper is the perfect person that needs a sidearm. That's nice. So, so that's how you can get them to, to push forward. trench oh my god dude all my guys got shot behind me are you serious Let's push up on mine. I guess a radio operator is good for... My God, did this just flip? Are you serious? It just flipped. Can we fix it?
are you oh my god dude go 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 This thing feels like it's actually upside down. Oh my god, no way. Did that actually just work? Is this a hostile tank? I don't think anybody's in it though. Yeah, it's definitely blown up. Yeah, fight against the tank. Good idea. Ah, come on, dude. I wish I could see. to give up with this tank uh worst worst tank driver ever yep i give up okay the control point is ours move out to the next one I just realized our tank people have pistols and I could take that off of them, I think, and throw them onto one of my other characters. Yo, what's going on, Living Legend? How you doing? What up, dude? Seems sketchy, but I'm giving it a try. Woo! Go, go, go! Jamming out to a song right now. Nice, nice. Always fun. Oh my god, my entire team is dead. My entire squad is dead. the name by non point oh my god i survived it's, it's a tank nice That's okay. I'll take it.
I hope there's something down the line that like helps your uh, your squad. Oh god. Use better abilities or get more proficient or something. Oh, double kill. Hey. Nice. play uh like battlefield at all legend God, dude, that guy just got so many kills. My entire squad just got wiped early on there, too. I played one of them. Uh, I was complete ass. But I like he could make buildings go boom. Yeah, dude. Destruction in Battlefield is sick. Um, so basically, this game... It's similar to Battlefield in the way of like there is some destruction and there's objectives like and all of that but um, the really neat thing about it is every time you spawn you spawn in with a squad um, oh. like I think that building just blew up completely yeah uh, but you spawn in with a squad and then, like I just died right there, I was a, you can swap to the next person in your squad. And you can also increase the amount of people that can be in your, t your squad and everything. So it's really neat. Um, Like on the left, I can see how many people are left in my uh, my squad right now. So there's about four guys left. I just died, so now I can swap over to this guy, Johnny Brown. I'm actually gonna swap over to Timothy Love. Very chaotic, too. Oh, I forgot. These guys aren't following me because they're trying to defend this building. So yeah, so now my entire squad died, but now I'll spawn, like here's your different squads that you have. And then when you select one, I'll spawn in as you can choose who you want to play as. 
So like I'll select this guy and I hit go and then it's going to spawn in with all these and all these guys will be following me. So boom, here they are. And I'm playing the one that I selected, but if I want to swap, boom, boom, boom. It's such a, a cool technique in my opinion, like gameplay aspect. I, I, I love it so far. And this game is free to play, which is also really neat. But honestly, I try to give it up. I played them COD my whole life, just got tired of it. Yeah, now I get that. Well, Call of Duty in itself, personally, I'm not, I've never really been the biggest fan other than the stories. The story, the campaigns for Call of Duty, I think are my favorite part. Other than that, they've always been, okay. I should have thrown that grenade back. Okay. Yeah, the Call of Duty multiplayer modes are very um, not friendly sometimes. And they're, they're full of, especially Modern Warzone, it's full of cheaters. It's so bad. Nice. New army level. And we unlock the, uh, the new squad too. We... Here it is. All right, so what do we have? Construction hammer, uh, perks, Springfield. Let's get this battle reward. Nice, so all these guys just upgraded or leveled up. Faster med pack usage, I will gladly take that. After quick turning of the firearm, less shot spread after quick turning of the firearm. Take the change pose. I am going to go to these guys and can I take their pistol? Ooh, I can. <laughs> I just gave myself a drop. Nice. I got a reward pistol order. But there's this open world online zombie survival game coming to PC sometime. It looks good. It's called The Day Before. Yeah, I was actually... Um, I was actually looking at it like yesterday or so. I think it looks pretty cool. I am definitely down to check that out once it drops. I'm taking all their sidearms because I never play these guys. And is it free? Nah, it's not. To manage squads for this engineer battalion. Go to these guys. First sidearm on him. I don't know if they can have sidearms yet. Not yet, but. They can now. Oh wait, never mind. <laughs> they can't. Oh, that's squad experience. So there's also soldier experience. 
Oh my god, now I'm reading this. Squad upgrades, personnel upgrades. I see. Wish it was on console, I don't know if my PC can handle it. Yeah. Sometimes it can be a little bit... Um, that's why I think PC gaming, personally, is one of the best. Because... Um, nice, I actually just got this in-game too. The order could only be obtained and used during Twitch drop events. Cool. Um, the the amount of games out there on, that are on PC is so cool, in my opinion. I absolutely love it. Nickel plated, nineteen eleven. <clears throat> but I know not everybody can get a PC, and it's understandable can be kind of expensive allows you to modify this weapon wait did we hit level th oh yeah we did we hit level 3 for the um the team I, I literally don't even know what to do right Squad XP. Uh, I'm going to look up. So I'm listed. Hold your Different squads, okay, here we go. Specialization, 12 different specializations. So you have trooper. Uh, troopers are semi-automatic rifles and bolt action rifles as their main weapons. This makes them effective to mid and long range. Mortar man, specialized in light mortars. And destroy several squads at once with one explosion. Sniper, obviously. Bomber can be armed with both an anti-rocket launcher and a powerful anti-tank rifle capable of penetrating even tank armor. Okay. Salter use submachine guns as their main weapon. Engineer. Support in battle. They can build fortifications and stationary firing positions. A wide, select, uh, wide selection of buildings for the engineers make them indispensable for countering all types of troops. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, and it rust. <laughs> yeah, that game's been out on PC for like so long. It'd be interesting once it drops on uh everything else. Gunner use light machine guns, yeah. Okay, radio operator. Specify map point can be called Houtzer fire effectively destroys infantry and will close or direct hit the projectiles even destroy armor. It takes time to reload. Flame trooper, that's pretty obvious. Shotgunner, pretty obvious. Pilot and tanker, okay. Cool, so that's a, a good explanation about everything. And I, if I wanted to, now, when do you get a radio operator? Seven, level seven, geez. And I think that's for the the campaign too Ooh, that is a grind just because uh, just hope that it's better than 7 days to die because it wasn't fan of that to be honest yeah I, I always saw a thing the other day apparently they're coming out with another one of that game or no 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 not 7 days I'm thinking of uh, the gate out of hell I think Yeah, I'll take more stamina. Generation out of combat.
I swap those two. All right, so back to the upgrades real quick. Um, I would love to get a radio operator for this squad. But we don't have one unlocked yet. I don't know if we have any people in our thing. Take that. That way we can get this one next time. Uh, squad personnel. Let's do plus personnel. Did I use this one yet? No, I didn't. Wow, we have three points available? That's why everybody in this is ranking up so fast. I need to level up my people faster. Jeez. Okay. I'm gonna actually swap those two. Why is this guy? This guy has this weapon. Make one of these instead. This guy can take the other one. One second. Just checking these. Uh, Saints Row got out of hell? No, no, there's a, a game literally called like, um, it's like Get Out of Hell or something like that. I forget, I can't remember. Something, 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 hell, I think. Yeah, Saints Row games are great. I, someday I want to replay them. It's been so long, though, since I played any of them. <laughs> but I definitely will one day. Weapon delivery. So it tells you what your chances are. Uh, yeah, I'd rather hold on. Hold off on buying one of these specifically yet. Could get one of these though. Sniper elite achievement. campaign so this is how you see your campaign leveling upgrades I think everybody is up to grit updated as much as it can be Elmer or Walter Elmers need a uh one of those to get him though. Okay, here we go. Back into the game. My doggo might bark in a second. Wow, it threw us right into this. It's crazy how these games are literally 10v10, but it, it feels like there's way more than that.
I need to figure out what that thing is. I wish all grenades were G. Like, let me just hit G. I didn't even realize I still had one guy left. Wow, they actually got some kills too. Oh. <laughs> All right, hold on, let me check. Uh, is it graphics? No, it's controls. <laughs> Why would it be graphics, dude? Smoke grenade, explosion pack. Can I make it, G? Also? Yes. Jeez. <laughs> All right, construction hammer. Ah, so that's how that works. Ammunition box, barbed wire, rally point. Okay.
These guys are always very motivated. Oh my god, dude, what the hell? Are you serious? Our forces are taking the control point. Oh, dude, I wish I had a grenade for that. It like doesn't like it when I try moving to the second. Back to my weapon. Are you serious? Oh my god, every single shot missed. Yeah, what's going on, Loki? How you doing? How you been? Nice. Oh my god, dude, I couldn't. Sometimes I feel stuck. Oh my god. <laughs> Just browsing uh, enlisted streams and saw a familiar name. Nice, nice. Have you been streaming recently? I don't know if I haven't gotten notifications or like, have you kind of been chilling for a bit now? Been a while. Low, low amounts. Okay, gotcha. Oh god. Oh god. Throw the grenade. And odd times. Okay, gotcha. Well, I hope everything is good. This game is pretty fun. Have you played it yet? Or were you just like checking it out right now? It's so much better than what I was expecting to be honest. I I could instantly tell earlier when I jumped into it um, that it was going to be my thing. So it's been really cool so far. Probably more consistently, uh, consistency again when I get my new work contract after May 10th. Nice. Um, I saw a guy back there. There's also a guy right there. Uh, played a, quite a bit of the beta. It's like. Jeez. Ah, damn it. Uh, quite a bit of the better said this that got reset now, but excited proper properly start leveling now permanently. Okay, so now it's going to be permanent leveling and stuff. Beforehand it wasn't. Because right now it's technically I mean it, if you look in the top right it says beta still. 
So I didn't think about that, but I'm I'm assuming now. Oh no, okay, gotcha, gotcha. So let, now it's open beta. So you played the closed beta. Okay, that makes sense. But they want to give like a fair chance for everybody. Cool. That's pretty neat. Yeah, it's it's been a lot of fun. Yeah, the buy-in early access closed beta. Okay, gotcha. Before Michael transaction, or Mike, yeah, Michael transaction. <laughs> gotcha. I I honestly did not know anything about this game until like two days ago, where I I saw somebody that I I, it's a YouTuber, um, he covers a ton of. Uh, like these types of games and I don't really like watch his videos a lot but sometimes I'll watch like a review and I saw he I follow him on Twitch and I saw he was playing a game called Enlisted so I just so happened to click on it and it was like let's see what is this and I I saw it for a split second so then I googled damn it <laughs> so I googled it and yeah here we are It's pretty cool though, in my opinion. I, I really like the the whole thing where you spawn with a squad and you can swap between them. I think that's such a cool mechanic. Like it keeps the action constantly like ongoing. And I've only been on one campaign right now as US soldiers, so. There's like so much to do now. I, I was not expecting as many maps as they have too. Cause there's, there's a ton of them. Damn. Uh, yeah, I can switch members. What? I could barely see him. Yeah, I've been playing since the alpha at the time. Only had like two maps in the Eastern Front campaign. It was pretty neat already. Uh, but they've done a lot to improve it. Yes, sizes are, are awesome. Also, once you upgrade the stuff, you probably get like seven man squad and stuff gets busy. Yeah, I, I right now I have like six man squads so far. Um, I even so I I've never really like bought anything for these types of games like uh, Warframe or any, or War, um, uh, War Thunder, but I got, I decided to get the 30 day thing for this one. Cause it's, it's pretty neat. And I can see myself like jumping into this game a good amount here and there. This, uh, this game will fill my battlefield void for a while. The campaign levels take a while to, to level up though, for sure. Yeah, until Battlefield 6. Yeah, that's for sure. That's for sure. <laughs> oh my God. Now I, I bound everything to G but now I can't use any of it. <laughs> oh shit. Damn it. Oh boy, that's gonna explode. What? Slow progression, but that keeps you playing, I suppose. True. Definitely does. I I want to try out like all the other classes and stuff, like the uh, the LMG people and other characters like that. Sounds really cool to me. 
the, the radio operator, I think, is going to be really neat. Is 100% a kamikaze. Yes. The maps really are like pure mayhem, and it's it's pretty cool. Do you know? Is there gonna be any way of? Oh, shoot. Um. Like, there are, are there abilities that make your squad members more effective or anything? Or is it just like their, uh, their AI is going to be their AI of what it currently is, I guess. Damn it. That could have been really good. Jeez. White. Yeah, so the builders are really nice because you can also make forward spawns and such. The the engineer people. Oh my god, dude, I'm getting wiped out every single time. I think there are some perks, but uh, general mode is potato with the occasional aimbot for bushes. <laughs> I think I've ran into that a few times. How, oh my god, this guy's the only one left. Uh, they've already tuned them a bit, but yeah, in earlier betas, it was proper strat to just park your bots in bushes beyond them so they don't care about foliage. Oh, okay. Oh god, I didn't even see that. <laughs> okay, so we have a construction guy now. So you're saying you use like engineers for like building the, uh, the rally point, this one? Damn it. Really? Oh my god. What is that? He just wiped my entire squad. Super nice since everyone in your t oh everyone in your team can spawn on it. That's really cool. I, I wish I could have made one like right here or something. Dude, is that a plane? Obviously need to have it not be destroyed, but yeah, it can help. For example, the D-Day map, that final point at the windmill is a super good spot for a forward spawn. Huh. Yeah, I can see that. Let me reset the controls. 
Uh, let me set the defaults. Yeah. It's such a weird button to press for smoke and that. Like G. I honestly. Oh, wow, that's melee. I did not know that. Go, go, go. Well, that's friendly. Oh, my God. I wish it would tell you what you're actually telling your teammate. Oh, grenade, grenade, run, run, run. Get out, no! No! <laughs> uh, I don't know if my, uh, I would have swapped to engineer if he was available. But... Once you upgrade a sniper, yeah. I really want to get like my infantry squad. I would love to get a radio operator in that. Jeez. This guy is so good. Oh, that's everybody. Oh, geez. All right, let's see. We got 17 seconds to take this point. There's no way you can toggle nameplates, is there? Do you know of? Oof. Too many casualties. We lost this battle. All right, it's good timing. I'm gonna actually take my dog out real quick. Not sure. Yes, yeah, same up the tree there, to be honest. Nice, nice. They leveled up to third place. Not bad. Is that 50 kills? Holy crap. I mean, okay. Okay. All right. I'm going to take my doggo out real quick and then we shall continue. So I will be right uh, back. All right, have a, have a good one, Loki. Sleeping for a bit, gonna catch some sleep. All right, sounds good. Thanks for stopping by, and uh, I will see you next time. Have a good one, man.
right chat i am back um we can probably do like one or two more matches and then i might be taking a a break for a bit um but we'll see let's uh upgrade these guys and then figure out yeah i'd rather take that faster health regeneration choose a new perk uh faster stamina regeneration that stamina upgrades all right so we can do squad or personnel hmm squad experience we have two points. Well, how about we do squad experience? And then that, and then that way we can do the, that, that one next time. Yes. We'll take the personnel increase. Reserve increase and one nice wow you can re <laughs> these squad ranks can be insane or the squad uh you can have like so right now this squad is at five but i could literally get it up to wait no is it yeah it's at five six what's the maximum for this one right now max is six right now but then seven eight nine oh my god it's insane That's really cool in my opinion. The more the merrier. Squad increase. Only thing is you actually need to unlock those amount of people. Right now we can't really get any more at the moment. Uh, you can buy them with, um, with points. Oh, I see 60. Okay. Are we at we're halfway halfway there to level four i think i will definitely do this one depending on how many squads you can have i probably would go oh there's a mortar one at level 13 geez um Fighter squadron, I think, will be really neat to have. Why is there? There's like a an up arrow on that one. I think I need to get more people with regular grenades. It costs two, really. Fine. This one's pretty good, to be honest. Right, is that what my main guy has? Ross, Mark Three, yeah. 
then this guy has Springfield. I think we have plenty of Springfields. Yeah, we have six of them. So we're, we are good on that. I'll take... Um, what happens if we switch to this one? Okay, huh. So yeah, you can actually do that too. I will take one of these. Nice, rank two. And do I want another one? Random upgrade level. Do you have to? Oh, wow. Why do they all have upgrades again all of a sudden? Take another one. I use him the most, so whip him with that. And then give Mr. Gerald here this one. Oh, okay. Yeah, and Timothy. Wait. Oh, he's a. Uh, never mind. He can't have one, this guy can. There we go. The other guy can have a submachine gun. But I, I didn't buy one yet, so. That is okay. I'm curious, can you do that? So it needs a minimum of four. I think all squads are minimum of four. Wait, I'm just curious. Can you actually do this? Like say if I wanted to swap the engineer with that guy. <laughs> you can. Even though there's no engineer. Huh. Okay. Interesting. So that that actually works. What happens if I say if I like took this engineer squad out? Can you? Like, can I just put it over here, or do you have to? I think you have to use it, but you can interchange them. So that's good. That's actually good to know. I could put the engineer into one of these classes, and have them level up in there instead of just leaving him specifically for the engineer uh, group. For now though, I will put him back in place of this guy and then boom. Five. I'll give this one. Uh, no. You know what? Let's let's cap them out. Oh wait, that's minimal of four. Cool. We are good. Sounds good. All right, let's do this. I, I'm really enjoying this game. I This is really cool. I always tried to get into um, uh, War Thunder, but I, I just, for some reason, never really could. 
I just feel like it, it's very in depth and there's tons of menus and everything and, and that's cool to a certain extent um, there's still there's still some in this but it's a different kind so I don't know maybe it's because it's also FPS too and you can still have the tanks you still have the all that other stuff which is really nice I also think it's pretty cool having like a full squad of like just straight up people Ooh, great I ever played this map yet. I forgot to equip somebody with the the new grenade that I bought. dead oh god they're all dead Oh, nice.
Nice. Oh God. This is who I started with, and now he's the last one alive. Ah, oh, damn it. Whoops. Yeah, I think I'm uh, after. Well, the next time my main squad upgrades, then I'm going to unlock it so that way I can throw an engineer into the squad and then um, put him in there and maybe do a sniper too because then i can take the sniper guy in my other spot and throw him in there as well which would be pretty neat I haven't figured out whether you can select um, What is this? Springfield? Why does it feel so so smooth? The enemy has captured control point Charlie. Maybe I think I'm now just now figuring out why it takes so long to swap. I think it's your overall like weapon swap thing, even though I'm not swapping to a weapon. It takes like three or four seconds. This guy is my last one. You help him cap. Yeah, let's go for him. Jeez. I, I haven't figured. I don't know if you can select your spawn point. I haven't tried yet, at least.
Come on, somebody's gotta have. Are you kidding me? Every oh wait, I forgot that you can check. Really, my entire squad that I have with me right now doesn't have any explosive items for a tank. We've lost control point Bravo. just sitting there too. All right, bravos. Clear again. Oh crap, I lost two of my guys. Saw that coming. <laughs> this team definitely needs to be larger. How is this one level nine? It, this team is level nine. I go with this guy. Ah, oh, I keep forgetting the check. I, need, I definitely need more people in this squad. I think I should unlock a sniper. No, maybe not a sniper for the other class. An, an engineer for my other one. Then a submachine gun. So that way we have variety in that. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> in that class. And then later on down the line, we can specialize in more. I don't know how I'm gonna get more uh, people unlocked though. I feel like that's the hard part now. It is nice though, at, because technically, as we level up the the group or the team, um, yeah, as we level up everyone else, we're continuously getting uh, more nice victory stuff. So, or as we level up the campaign, sorry, I'm like trying to speak processing. <laughs> as we level up the campaign, we unlock more squads. Nice. They went up. Sweet. And we're almost at three now too, which is very nice. Capture one strategic point. Order of weaponry. Yeah, we need to win three battles in squads mode. Kill 50 enemies using machine gun. Ooh, boy. You can change this battle task to another one. You can change four ba battle tasks daily. Okay. Let's change this one. Okay. Really? Okay. That's how you get them, by doing this. Uh, oh. Wait, did we unlock that yet or no? Earn stars for completing three battle battle tasks per day. 
Lone Fighters, a game mode in which players use only one soldier at a time without AI soldiers in their squad. Interesting. I I definitely like the squads though. Of changing pose, reduce the effect of head shaking caused by nearby explosions. 75% head pack usage. Damn, son. I'm crawling or crouching, yes. Upgrades. Okay, so this is this squad. I will do an engineer for this one. Can't do bomber, engineer, radio. Salter, gunner. When do we unlock gunners? Gunner isn't until level 11, jeez. That is a ways off from now. <sighs> Sniper, engineer. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, engineer. Yeah. Having unlocked plus one, you can no longer unlock plus one radio. Yeah, we can still get a radio one down here. Yes. Cool. Then for this one, squad size, squad size, or squad experience. Let's do squad experience. This one is plus one engineer to the squad. Reserve squad size. Personnel, let's do personnel. This one. So even though this is an engineer combat battalion, I am going to start swapping some characters around. It's nice that it's not required to have an engineer in that one. Yeah, I did. So I'm gonna throw this guy first. Let's take one of these. So like Ralph Patrick. Oh, uh, we get 160 because oh wow, that's a lot of people anyways. Uh okay. Take all that. Do we have any more engineers? Swap these guys out. Throw this guy right there. Go up here. Throw in Mr. Engineer. Wait, why is he only plus 25 for, from squad upgrades? Everyone else is plus 100. Is he plus 100 in the other one? No, he's plus 25 in this one, too. Huh. What? I didn't see. Upgrades. Uh... 
Okay, we're almost at four, five, six. Oh, that's the uh, so at six, you get the flame trooper five. Do you get any new ones? No, but you get the M1 carbine at five. Flame trooper seven is when you get the radio operator eight. It's that, and it goes on and on and on. Ooh, that one's nice. <laughs> I just wanted to see Jesus dude oh my god no why does it say it says I already have the the invasion of Normandy Yara is a naughty girl. Okay, you have to be careful. If you click on these, then it automatically buys it. So I'm trying not to click on any of them. Uh, Give me a random one. It's a machine gun. That's exactly what I wanted, actually. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Nice. I could go have these guys train, but then I would lose two of them, and I don't have a way to get more yet, so I think I'm going to hold off on that just yet um one sec chat Chad, I will be back in a little bit. I am going to go eat something real quick, so I will be a V. All right, chat, I am back. Uh, let's see how many games we can get in here. Everything is pretty much all set, so we're jumping right into another game. Oh, it's sending us back to uh to this. I can't believe there's still so many other characters too for like each <laughs> faction. Oh god, that's terrifying. No! All my members. Oh my god, dude. Literally my entire squad. My good people, too. Come on, dude, we got this. What? 
I have no idea. Wait, does this, does this other guy have the sniper rifle? Oh god. I swapped this gun to the other guy. Yeah, I literally have a level three in this sniper group here. I'm gonna try going in as a tank. Can you change the camera in a vehicle? Repair, steer, horn, next gear, look out the hatch, control. I'm coming back. Hold on. Oh God. the fire
where I got stuck the last time I tried doing this. Are you kidding me? I fired that right at them. Vehicles on fire. I just got burned. serious Yeah, I literally have a rank three trooper in this 
squad that I barely use, so I need to throw him into mine. I hear you, Kiara. I hear you. Dude, how? Why is this guy all the way back here? We've almost captured the point. Hold on. Hold on tight. We're on the last objective. That is insane. Get some. Are you serious? Oh my god. <laughs> Why does it always hurt? Oh my god. that
Nice. We won. Perfect timing. And we hit level four. Nice. Uh, don't think any. Oh, wow. They did level up. Lock now. Managing squads. Bump that there. All right. So I'm going to do some quick managing. And then we are good. That one. Okay. So. Let me take my two lowest guys from this one. So five. These are all level twos. And then, okay. Oh, wait a minute. That guy's a sniper. Oh, they're different snipers. That's why. give him one of those that guy can have three okay yeah I'm gonna swap out this guy one, two, three. Got the plane with this guy. New campaign available. Oh, I was just saying the other one's available. Okay, cool. Go to this. Forty percent more resources available for building. Sure. Upgrades. Hmm. For now, let's do the squad size. Sure. Soldier class veteran unlocks the final upgrade for soldiers of this class. Veteran soldiers have better stats. You get this upgrade perk by re-rolling it in a soldier menu. Huh. Okay. It's 
So I don't understand how this this group is so much higher than the other one. I don't get it. I uh, yeah. Squad upgrades. Personnel. New personnel. I will take a random trooper. Oh, nice. He's an engineer. Oh, he's a fighter pilot. Wait, did I get another fighter fighter pilot? I did. Okay. Interesting. Oh, looks like we're throwing this engineer in here. Level three, too. I take this guy's weapon. <laughs> 